Yeah, definitely so. There's still some slick spots here or there uh, while I hold things down here. And, uh, you know, Jesse, Jesse can handle things from the studio. You send me out into the field and, uh, you know, report remotely. And so the Bureau in Collin County, I can, I can report uh, to you, is doing okay. A little cold out here, but doing okay. Thankfully to see the sunshine at the moment. Oh, my little uh, weather thermometer turned off on me. 37 degrees in the sunshine. You see that? Nice to see. Well above freezing. That's why we've had a good deal of melting this afternoon. Look at the road back here behind me. That's a you know residential road. It is dry. I mean, bone dry. Absolutely great to see. Now, the problem is, is you still have spots like this right here that have been in the shade most of the day and are still rather snow and ice covered. It's a little slushy. I can get out here and just kind of you know kick some of the snow and some of the slush away. But the second that we drop down below freezing a little later on this evening, all of that was just going to completely turn to just solid ice again. And even up here at that intersection, you can see that's going to turn to solid ice again. So out and about this evening and into tonight, you got to watch out for the slick spots and especially tomorrow morning as well, because anything that's slushy out there right now, absolutely going to refreeze. But honestly, sites like that behind me with that, you know, bone dry road, that is great to see. And honestly, a little bit better than I thought it was going to be at this point in the day. So we'll gladly take it, but definitely use caution this evening and into tomorrow morning as well.